The self-consistency principle was established by Rolf Hagedorn in 1965 to explain the thermodynamics of fireballs in high-energy physics collisions. A thermodynamical approach to the high-energy collisions first proposed by E. Fermi. Partition function The partition function of the fireballs can be written in two forms, one in terms of its density of states sigma e and the other in terms of its mass spectrum rho m the self-consistency principle says that both forms must be asymptotically equivalent for energies or masses sufficiently high asymptotic limit. Also, the density of states and the mass spectrum must be asymptotically equivalent in the sense of the weak constraint proposed by Hagedorn as L O G rho m equals L O G Sigma E Display style log rho M equals log Sigma E. These two conditions are known as the self consistency principle or bootstrap idea. After a long mathematical analysis, Hagedorn was able to prove that there is in fact Rho M Display style text style row m and sigma e display style text style sigma e satisfying the above conditions, resulting in row m equals a m minus five two e x p beta o m display style rho m equals m caret minus 5 halves exp beta underscore o m and sigma e equals b e alpha minus 1 E x p beta o e display style sigma e equals b caret alpha minus one e x p beta underscore o e with a display style text style a and alpha display style text style alpha related by alpha equals a v 2 pi beta 3 5 display style alpha equals frac avenue 2 pi beta caret 3 fifths then the asymptotic partition function is given by z Q V O T equals one beta minus beta O alpha minus one Display style z underscore q v underscore o t equals big frac one beta beta underscore o big caret alpha minus one, where a singularity is clearly observed for beta. Display style beta beta o display style beta underscore o. This singularity determines the limiting temperature T O equals one beta O display style text style T underscore O equals one beta underscore O 
in Hagedorn's theory, which is also known as Hagedorn temperature. Hagedorn was able not only to give a simple explanation for the thermodynamical aspect of high energy particle production, but also worked out a formula for the hadronic mass spectrum and predicted the limiting temperature for hot hadronic systems. After some time, this limiting temperature was shown by N. Kabibo and G. Parisi to be related to a phase transition, which characterizes by the deconfinement of quarks at high energies. The mass spectrum was further analyzed by Stephen Frouchy. Topic: <laughs> Q exponential function. The Hagedorn theory was able to describe correctly the experimental data from collision with center of mass energies up to approximately 10 GeV, but above this region it failed. In 2000 I. Bediaga, E. M. F. Corrado and J. M. de Miranda proposed a phenomenological generalization of Hagedorn's theory by replacing the exponential function that appears in the partition function by the Q exponential function from the Salis non-extensive statistics. With this modification the generalized theory was able again to describe the extended experimental data. In 2012 A. Deppmann proposed a non-extensive self-consistent thermodynamical theory that includes the self-consistency principle and the non-extensive statistics. This theory gives as result the same formula proposed by Bediaga et al., which describes correctly the high-energy data, but also new formulas for the mass spectrum and density of states of fireball. It also predicts a new limiting temperature and a limiting entropic index. See also Particle physics <laughs>